I had a signal or a message or something. Uh, I'm in my kitchen cooking, preparing some, some vegetables to freeze. And my mind gets my mind gets to drift and I end up receiving lots of good things this way. And because I have a lot of Christian friends, I know still, um, I was guided to say this message. So I started receiving the worry of uh, like that a group of Christian people would be worried that this is devil's work because it is said where two or more are gathered in my name, there am I in your midst kind of a thing. So there's a lot of people feeling like this is devil's work or this is this is the you know the result of evil and it's trying to keep us separate and so we cannot do our prayer work and this and that, right? I mean, this is the feeling that I got, and I'm sure, I mean, this is, this. that seems logical that that is probably a worry for a lot of people. But here's what I was told. We're thinking too strict. There are no rules about this. You know that. Look in your heart. We're, 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 I think, I can't remember if it's where two or more are gathered or if we're three are gathered. We're two or three, where two or three are gathered. No, it's where two or more are gathered there am I in your midst. That doesn't mean physically. Where does it say physically? So let's say, Christian friends, um, you want to have an impact, a prayerful impact. Well, then do it. Where two or more gather, there am I in their midst. If we are all praying about the same thing, we are gathering together. We are gathering together. Where do you think that, that those prayers go? They're collectively gathering. So don't think that it has to be physical gathering. Don't give up either, you know. Where your mind goes, the energy for it goes. So if your mind is seeing a cure or that a, a resolution. See, I wouldn't even be specific. I would be praying for a positive resolution to the whole thing. You know, no, don't be specific because the universe will figure it out for us in the most positive way if that's what we're going to be praying for. So seriously, all of us gather together over this next how many days there's so many millions of us around the world, all collectively sending prayers, sending light, sending intention, sending, sending energy. Thoughts are energy. Prayers are energy. We are sending them out. So all over the world, 24 hours a day, someone somewhere is doing the same thing that you're doing. So it is there is more than just you doing it. So where two or more are in my midst, there are my, you know, where two or more gather in my name, there am I in their midst. We are gathering. Everyone. There's people everywhere. So at any point in time during your day, if you think for a moment and you send that energy, that emotion, that prayer, that meditation, that whatever you want to call it, it's all the same. It really is. We're all doing the same thing, and if we could see that collectively, we can move mountains. Oh my gosh, can we move mountains? But yes, don't think that we have to physically be together to do the same work. We don't. Where two or more are gathered in my name, there am I in their midst, means at any point in time, Anyone anywhere around the world is pretty much doing the same thing that you're doing, sending up prayerful intentions for a positive outcome to this whole situation that is happening worldwide. And that's it. That's it. Focus on that for a good five minutes. That is bigger than anything you could possibly do. Do it many times a day. Let your mind slip over. But always think positive because the more negative we put out there, the more vibration towards the negative. Let's think about the most, just say, you know, you don't need to create, you don't need to create the outcome. Just leave it open. Most positive outcome for the whole thing around the world. That's it. That's it.
we're going to get through this. Don't worry anyone. I am telling you, there is not a worry. Yes, people are passing. Yes, this is happening, and it's so sad. But yet, there's more to life. Death is a part of life as well. And we keep going. We keep moving on. Our energy still moves on. So we're never gone for real. Keep prayerful, keep mindful, keep positive.